I'll be showing the brand new OneNote Live Captions feature. This feature fuses OneNote together with Microsoft Translator and Live Captions to allow the most inclusive note-taking experience I've ever seen. This is rolling out right now into private beta and will be showing up later in 2020 in a much more broad rollout. So we'll start out as the educator. The educator has Microsoft Translator, which is free. It's in the web. It's on iPhone. It's on Android. It's a free app and it will translate and caption in real time in over 67 languages. So the scenario is the educator is going to kick off a translator session and hit start and enter. And we've got a video, you can get all the details on how Translator is used, but assume I'm gonna start a session as an educator. And it's gonna create a join code, you can see here. This join code will be shared with the students in the class. And this could be remote teaching, this could be in a lecture hall, it can be in various ways. All you need is that five digit join code. Now imagine that the educator has shared the join code with the student who's using OneNote, and now we're gonna switch into OneNote and see exactly how this works. Here I am in OneNote for the web, and I'm gonna to go to the View tab. And I'm the student in this case. So the student is in here, and way over on the right here, there's a Live Captions button, and I'll click that. The Live Captions pane opens. Now as the student, I'm gonna paste that join code my educator gave me and join the session. And I'm gonna choose a captions language. You'll see there are almost 70 languages in here, and I'm gonna choose English to start and click join, but I could choose a different language and caption in that language. Now, what you're seeing on the right are captions coming through in real time. So if I'm a student, I can get these captions right here, and I can take notes at the same time. So over here in OneNote, I can still say, I am taking notes. Now, let's say the educator was saying something and I was like, wait, I, I forgot what they were saying. That was something important. In the upper right, I'll click pause. I can pause those captions in real time. So now I can go up here and maybe I wanna highlight something. So I'm gonna turn on the yellow highlighter and I'm gonna go and I'm gonna highlight something. That's yellow, that's important. Oh, this part is important here. And maybe I wanna go and uh, change the colors to make a different color. And I can even make the text bigger. So if I drop down this right here, I can make the text a little bigger so I can see it. Now the educator's continuing to talk while I pause these captions. And a lot of students would worry that they're gonna miss all that information. Well, if I hit resume, what you can see is everything that the professor or the educator was saying is captured right here. So that is really inclusive. Maybe that's something where there's too much information coming and I couldn't absorb it all. Now the other nice thing is that everything that I was saying is automatically captured. Look over here on the left, you're gonna see a transcripts section that is automatically created. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna close the live captions pane, and when I switch over to transcripts, you'll see everything that was being talked about was captured automatically and saved in my OneNote, the entire transcript. So you can see on the transcripts section, this page was automatically created and it has the join code, the transcript, the date. It even captures all the highlights that I made when it was over there in the captions pane. So all transcripts are automatically saved. And we know from research that having transcripts and live interactive captions helps improve student outcomes across the board inclusively. Now I'll briefly show using live captions using a different language. So again, on the view tab, way over on the right, I click live captions and I'll enter my join code. And this time I'm gonna choose a different language. There's all these different languages here. And the language that I choose in this case is going to be Japanese and I'll click join. Now you can see the Japanese characters coming through. And if I speak a different language than maybe the educator speaks, this is very easy for me to follow along. Maybe I'm sitting way back in the class or maybe I wanna make sure to capture everything for later. I can do the same as before and everything will go into the transcripts. So this is OneNote Live Captions. It's going into beta, into private beta this month and later in 2020, this will be rolling out much more broadly. We believe this continues to make OneNote the most inclusive note-taking solution on the planet. If you found this video useful and you want to make sure you get all of my latest quick tip updates, subscribe to my YouTube channel and ring the bell to get the notification.